Penal Code 18710 makes it a crime to have possession of a destructive device. This includes bombs, grenades, rocket-propelled missiles. The key thing to know is that it's illegal even to possess, even to have these, even if you never use these in a violent manner and never intend to use them in a violent manner. So for example, you may have a grenade, uh, you know, old World War II grenade as a souvenir that you sort of keep in your room or on your mantle. Merely having that it is enough to constitute this crime. Now, possession of a destructive device under Penal Code 18710 is a wobbler. That means it can be filed as either a misdemeanor or a felony. As a felony, you could face up to three years in custody, as well as losing your gun rights. Moreover, it's a terrible red flag to have on your record, because if you're applying for a job and your employer sees that you've had possession of a destructive device, trust me, you're not somebody that they're going to want to have in the workplace. So to the extent that you're charged with this crime, you want to do everything that you can to fight it and to keep it off your record. And here at Shouse Law Group, we've been able to do just that with a great deal of success. So for example, the police may have discovered the so-called destructive device uh, or, or bomb or grenade uh, as part of an illegal search, uh, such that we might be able to get the whole thing thrown out of court. It may be that the item that the police found really does not meet the legal definition of a destructive device. And we see a lot of cases wrongly charged for just that reason. Or it may be a situation where you genuinely did not realize that it was a destructive device. So for example, maybe you have an old uh, sort of army missile launcher that you keep as a souvenir and you didn't realize that there was some live ammunition in there. If you're in one of these situations, we invite you to contact us here at Shouse Law Group. We'll see what we can do to get your charges reduced or dismissed.